Meanwhile, governorship primary elections are fast approaching and different aspirants are putting their acts together. In Abia State, the PDP is doing all it can to retain its mandate in 2023. And one of the aspirants, Mayor Loki Bukwe, is insisting that if the party will put its best foot forward at the polls, he remains the best candidate for the ticket. We have him joining us tonight via Zoom. You're welcome to our Pride Time News, Mayor Ibukwe. Hello, good evening. Good evening. And Abia people have since been yearning for inclusiveness in governance. How do you plan to achieve this? Well, uh, I'm on ground so far, and uh, I'm also in touch with my people, home and abroad. Uh, I speak directly almost to them, and I know what they need, and I think uh, we're ready to work and also work with everybody who is willing and who has something to offer in the state. Um, when you talk about uh, my people, we're talking about those on ground and those in diaspora who uh, is willing to change the situation and the narrative of our dear state. I'm in touch with the people from the north to the south, from the south to the to the west. You know, we we are ready to to put things that uh, that will make it different by having the point people all over the local governments who are ready to give us information of what is on ground and how we can be able to enhance them to improve the. Uh, the living of the people. Okay, um, uh, we know that um, people in Aba Abia State are people with business and marketing strategy. So now that brings us to the question to Aba to the world. You know, the area area mm -hmm. market in Aba could have been an African hub if properly managed and adequately invested in. So do you have any blueprint for Aba market? Yes, most definitely. Aba is the honeypot. Look at look at when you can see. Uh, the wet right there, but the, the issue is how to harness it in order to generate funds into the state. Uh, any state with a bar and well harnessed will make a lot of progress. We plan of uh, working on infrastructure, improving on infrastructure road, the market that needs to be relocated will be relocated to a very good place, build the roads, in order to help the business people and also help them by connecting them to the uh, to the market bond, such as the, even CBN, by the state guaranteeing them on how to access funds. Then I have plans as well, putting up a cargo company through the Abia transport line, helping them to move their goods without having a roadblocks that will increase um, stock to the end users. So we have a lot of things in stock to, in order to enhance uh, the uh, the potentials of ABA. Okay, so now um, Governor Okeze Peazo has set the monthly IGR at three billion naira. He's even looking at the possibility of five billion naira. So what are you promising in this regard, and how do you plan to go about it? Okay, by the time we we uh, fix the infrastructure of ABA, relocate the market to a, uh, a very good place for the business people, helping them with the, how to move their goods into Abia states, into ABA, then uh, also helping them with uh, market, uh, money market bond. You will know that uh, definitely we're going to increase on the idea even above 10 billion. It's all about the energy, who is willing to use a different approach in order to, to, um, to increase the well-being of the people, especially in ABA. And you also know that ABA has a lot of talented people. And I, in my, in my seven-key agenda, I have a program called um, Loan Accessibility. Okay. Oh, Nigeria. Okay. The Loan Accessibility is um, we setting up uh, something like a microfinance Oh. helping them to have assets. You know, recently, they have difficulty in assessing dollars to buy goods outside the country. Okay, okay. All right, um, we, we want to thank you so much for this information so far. We would have been able to ask more questions, but for time. So thank you for joining us.
Have a good evening. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.